about our schools. Um, I wanted to focus a little bit more on what everybody can do. We have um, kids who come to school and they estimate that our children, children like ours, have heard three million fewer words by the time they start kindergarten than students in better performing schools. So what that tells me is if, if you see a child, if you see a little one like this when she's awake, talk to them. And I don't mean talk at them, you know, or we all do that, you know, don't do this, do that, do that, but have conversations with them. Talk to them about what you're interested in. Talk to them about what they're interested in. Take them places, do things with them. It's, um, it's an easy thing to do. It's something you can do. Take them to the library. We have a, a wonderful uh, library director, Ms. Marcus Bay, and I intend to talk with her in the near future. I uh, found out recently that the Confucius Institute down at Cleveland State is going to offer us some services. Now, there's nothing definite, but um, it's something else that we can offer our children because if we want them, some of them, to follow in the footsteps of our president or our senators or our other high elected officials. They need to know about the world. And so that's, that's another thing that might help out with them. We have some underutilized services in our schools. We have a wonderful scope program with very tiny classes. And if we have some high achieving students they could um, come into those classes and we could have slightly larger but still very small classes. But that's, it's just an underutilized service in our schools. Um, some of our other services are, are also underutilized. And making sure that the kids get to the school, get there on time, get there regularly. How can they learn if they're missing a lot of classes? So if you have any contact with the children in, in the district, help make sure that they get there. Help make sure that they get to bed. Help, help make sure that they are ready to be there on time and ready to perform. So I mean, that's just a, a quick summary of some of the things that you in the community that we can do together to help the schools perform in a better way. Now the schools, we're doing a lot, Mrs. Corley gave you a lot of information about the things we offer, but it, it takes two for anything to happen. All right. Thank you very much. Give a round of applause. Tiffany Nicole Fisher,